Hey guys, it's Nate here. Welcome back to some more Fallout 4. In the last episode, I damn near had an anxiety attack trying to figure out my plan of attack for the main quest line, but I believe I have it down now. I'll explain as I go along because if I do now, we'll be on the pause screen for five minutes. So last episode, I got a quest called Underground Undercover, where I'm supposed to speak with uh, Tinker Tom. After getting asked by Dez at least 15 times if I wanted to join the railroad to help oh, them man, free the sense. There? Inside the belly of the beast? No time for that though. Let's set you up to contact Patriot. I got here one genuine Tinker Time special. Just load her up onto a holotape, plug her into any institute terminal, and execute. See, I'd probably use yours, but I need the mod to be fixed first. You from one of those vaults? You got too many teeth to be a scab. Um, what is that supposed to mean? I downloaded, it, it seemed like a bunch of mods, but it took me like two hours to figure everything out and download it. At least not so. Uh, oh, I probably shouldn't go out that way. Oh, wait, I'm fast traveling anyway. So... The quest I'm supposed to be doing, I am traveling to the Institute, yes? Okay. I, I assume it's the same in Institute terminal that, uh... I used to get the Minutemen the data. So just so I don't scare anyone when I teleport, I'm just gonna go in here and then uh, teleport myself. Uh, good, there's no map marker. Wait, oh, I cannot go there yet. I must check on Virgil. I have held it off for way too long. And I'm about to go through like the two low doors that it takes to get outside. Even though I already went through one of them. Okay, that's very bright. I've not checked on Verge. It's been like <sighs> because I took time off to level up and find all the magazines. The, the the time that I was supposed to go after him, I said, oh wait, I shouldn't go check on him yet. It's only been three days, and he said come back in a week. So I waited until a week passed, but then I started doing more things, and then time got away from me, and then this happened. So I'm going to go check on Virgil. I didn't put on a hazmat suit, neither did Deacon. This may be problematic. Look, unless you want me to Oh my back, god. Okay, yeah. Problematic. <laughs> Jesus. I know how to play a game. I swear. God, it's a lot of radiation. <laughs> it's a stupid way to have to waste a stim pack. I, I won't go through giving Deacon one because uh, we're only going to be here for a little bit. Just might as well put this on now. Virgil! Some refinement, but uh, I think we can consider my serum a qualified success. Qualified success? This is a qualified success? There were some side effects to the process. I seem to have hair again. Yeah, you do. It retains some muscle mass. The genetic resequencer needs more work. Still, I take your point. This is a significant advance, but only for one strain of FEV. It will take years, perhaps decades, to generalize my formula. Still, you have my gratitude. Oh, he means to cure every super mutant. Piece of my lab. Oh, or that's an odor. Help yourself to any of this junk if you want it. In the meantime, I have a lot of experiments to run. Excuse me. Okay, so Virgil's fine. Nothing to worry about. Um, is there anything I do want to take? Um. I remember, well, I'll take the bobby pins. Protect and serve. Yes, I know. Take that for cooking. Same with that. I don't need a rad scorpion stinger. Super mutant bracers. I think Strong already has those, even though I haven't taken them out for anything yet. Sorry, I'm rather busy right now. It's alright, Virgil. I'll be going. I just noticed my health didn't go up. It's fine. Alright, so I work up, this is me explaining as I go along, I work up until 
uh, my quests for the Institute go up to uh, keep working for Father. That's what I'm supposed to do. And the fact that the game keeps referring to him as Father is not okay. That is my son. Alright? I prefer to call my 60-year-old son <laughs> Sean. Ow, a forgot about man. that. You must be very proud. Wait for yeah, there it is. Why do I lose health when that happens? Alright, this guy helped me a lot. I might not kill him as hard when I <laughs> destroy the institute. Because he, he that's that's how I got all this uh sick oh, oh yeah, forgot about that. That's how I got all this uh sick armor. Sick armor. Um what am I doing? Uh terminal. On, oh, on any institute terminal. Okay. I... Can I... How far up can I go if I go to the... Elevator? Oh god, it comes from all the way up there. Oh no, it's fine. It's right there. Do I go down, though? Oh no, I go up. Okay. I prefer to do it... I know... I'm being OCD about nothing, but I prefer to use the same terminal that I used for the Minutemen because Sturgis was satisfied with it and he's still looking at it, even though it's just a placeholder for me, uh, for my absence of a negative status or standing with the Institute. So, am I here? Yeah. Alright, same terminal, and besides, no one's here, so it won't look suspicious as hell. I don't need the emergency relay button. You might need that later. Alright, um, not that one, that one's mine. Encrypted message holotape? That is what he gave me, right? Uh, message from Tom. The big... Is that what you call Des? The big D demanded a tutorial. <laughs> Sorry. Tutorial be included, so here it is. Short version. Plug this into any institute terminal and copy the message. Long version. Patriot's been sending us short-coded messages for years using an evil little encryption scheme. It was a bitch and a half to reverse engineer. Patriot's got skill, but I nailed it. Put this holotape on any put this holotape on any institute terminal and it'll deliver a sorry, a gift wrapped message. Okay, straight to Patriot. You're going into the belly of the beast, friend. Don't trust anything. TT out. Detective foreign program holotape hijack. Copying urgent reply 01 from terminal. Copy complete. Acknowledged. Meet the advanced systems maintenance room. Oh, that's just me going back in. Okay. Oh, I thought I saw someone moving. Uh, I was about to... I was... <laughs> if that happened, I was actually screwed. Oh, wait, it's open. Yeah, if that happened, I was actually screwed. I'm not supposed to blow my cover just yet. I hate that I have to blow my cover on purpose. And the fact that these split quest lines aren't more pronounced. I've had that problem since I was a hundred hours into New Vegas. Where's the Oh Our technology must seem pretty advanced. Thank you, Allie. Um down there. I assume this is a private meeting. That has no door. Hi. Hey, it's me. So you're the one who sent the encrypted message. How did you even do that? I wasn't sure anyone on the surface would have a chance to crack Trinity. You know, the encryption algorithm. Well, I certainly didn't. Tom cracked it. 
A friend named Tinker Tom cracked your encryption. He must have had some serious hardware to pull that off. Wow, your message was only one word. Friend. What did you mean by that? We both help since. The railroad's in the business of helping since too. That makes us friends. What? The railroad? As in the railroad? Pretty sure. I kept sending synths to the surface hoping someone would help them. I hoped the railroad got to some of them, but I never knew for certain. This is definitely the, uh, hmm. Wow, we're going to downplay the railroad? Is that what we're going to do? This is really like, you know, the futuristic underground railroad. I like it. How did you help the synths escape? Through hacking. The departments focus their best talents on hard science. Why waste time on terminal security, right? The SRB is the exception, and unfortunately, they control which synths go to the surface. But a forged work order from, let's say, bioscience can get a hand-picked synth on surface detail. And it turns out the railroad was waiting for them. Wow. You've saved a lot of synths. So much to take in. But wait, with you in the picture, I have this idea to rescue a lot of synths at once but we'll need help where's he working now right let's go to the west atrium probably best to talk about something else right now okay you can't go through no, walls my father thinks it's a living hell on the surface but that can't be right heck you look positively normal to me uh no offense none taken i'm not sure if we could ever make the surface actually a decent place to live that doesn't mean we shouldn't at least try to help, you know? Hey, when I finish my settlement, it's gonna be bitching, okay? Sorry. <laughs> Where are we going? I'm pretty sure we don't talk in front of that guy. He's here. Oh, Z he's the guy. It's me. Sir, do you require something? It's okay, Z1. She's a friend. Oh my god. She's with the railroad. <laughs> Meeting here is dangerous, and you bring a stranger. You. How do I know we can trust you? I'm fighting for you. Because the members of the railroad have dedicated their lives to fight for your freedom. I, I thought only Mr. Benet cared. But your friends actually fight for us? That's what the railroad does, Z1. She's from the surface. I've never met another human willing to help. But, sir, we must make this quick. Right now. How many synths want to escape, Z1? The ones I know for certain. Thirteen. Jesus. That'll take forever. Let's free those thirteen all in one go. I would do anything for my people. But how do we get them to the teleporter? It's no good. The old maintenance tunnels that lead there are always sealed. By the SRB. Hmm. If I can find a way to open those doors, could you get your synths to the teleporter room? Yes. We'll talk later. Someplace more secure. Again, you would think the Institute, with all their advanced technology, would have a way of knowing if someone was a rat. Liam. Just a few high security doors, right? Controlled by cutting edge SRB security tech. Yeah. A head on hack is the sucker play. So we go at them sideways. You're willing to help, right? I can't do this alone. Of course. Of course, I'll help you. Our core security architecture hasn't fundamentally changed from the old CIT days. The original security program was called Code Defender. Revolutionary stuff. We still have terminals running version 1, mothballed in storage. With some persuasion, I can get an old terminal to interface with the new security terminals. Enough to open doors, at least. Problem is, I can't even crack version 1. So I need a good old-fashioned username and a password. And that's nowhere to be found in the Institute. But if you could get me a pre-war admin password from the surface, I could log right in. And oddly specific, where? Where would I find that? Unfortunately, I don't know. The obvious place won't work. The CIT ruins were picked clean years ago, but some of the admins had to live off campus. Ask your friends in the railroad. I need those login credentials. Sure. I assume... Just me using intuition, I assume the college admin building? 
just just using my intuition. I don't know if I'm right. Again, forgot about teleportation. Jeez. Still walking. Des. Oh, we're busy. Half of you know this already, but something so big. I can't ask people to keep it secret any longer. The rumor is true. One of our agents has made it inside the Institute. Is this what Tinker Tom was working on? Yes, Tom's work is related. But the device and the assembly was the Wanderer's doing. Thanks. After the device was assembled, she made it inside the Institute and then back out. Where is the Institute? We're not sure exactly. Best guess is that it's somewhere under the old CIT. But they've been using a teleportation device to get in and out, so it could be anywhere. What did she find out? I know you all have questions, but I've said everything I'm going to. But know this, the ops you're planning and running now are the most important of our lives. We have a chance at rescuing more sins than we ever dreamed of. So get it done. Up there, assume you're being Desdemona. watched. The importance Always. of Bunker Hill and our asset there is not widely known. Please keep it that way. When running synths out of the wealth, the wastelanders can be a bigger problem than even the Institute. Wait. So you and Glory got assigned the same op. Compartmentalization of Intel does have its cost. Really want the freedom trade. Desdemona. What's happening? The business with the neighbor is concluded, right? The extent of our operation there is quite sensitive. Um H two twenty two made it out of the common rooms. It's a tradition to down a glass for your first successful run. Well done. Desdemona. God damn it! Losing Augusta is a real blow. Not your fault, I know. I don't want to talk about Blackburn. Carrington is sure to give me an earful about it. I think I missed all this. After switchboard, last time. Well, I'm hoping running your safe house will be good for both of you. One more time, I'm checking the wiki. Desdemona. Establishing Mercer's safe house is a sign we're on the road to recovery. Thank you for that. This is okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have to look at what's wrong I'm not getting anything Tom's camera online? The runners are gonna find that very useful. Pam, too. Desdemona. I know taking out coursers is a risk, in more ways than one. But we have to delay the Institute any way we can, so your infiltration can be effective. Good work on Augusta. I'd rather know the hard truth than live in ignorance. Desdemona. It's not an easy road you've chosen, but you're never alone in this. Working with compartmentalized information is a difficult transition for new agents. She didn't give her speech yet. Desdemona. The importance of Bunker Hill and our asset there is not widely known. Please keep it that way. 
What's happening? So you and Glory got assigned the same op. Compartmentalization of intel does have its cost. Ball blue. Huh? It's apparently a. Not a bad look. Okay, I think I did something wrong here. And I'm not entirely sure what it was. I'm not sure if fast traveling back to Railroad HQ is a bad thing. I don't know. I was also faffing around trying to find the secret entrance. But I just figure I'll go into the tr oh yeah. <laughs> um I just figured I'd try and go in through uh the church, maybe. Cause I'm not finding anything that just doesn't say she won't talk to me. I know where the credentials are, and I was close, but not that close. It wasn't in the admin building. Guys, it looks like I'm going to have to cheat. I broke Desdemona. I'm, I'm not sure if I actually broke Desdemona, but something bad is happening with her. Like, she's not uh, advancing the quest at all. Um, so, I hope I'm doing this the right way. I'm not. I'm trying to remember when I did it before, but I'm not sure the quest IDs. Let me look that up real quick. Um, that is... Oh god, is there an achievement attached to it? If I don't get this achievement because it's bugged, I'm going to be mad. Alright. Two D four eight, And... Set stage to... I feel like I'm typing in the commands to a time machine. Technically I am. 375. Okay. And then... Set stage to 400. Because that should be. Right, I'm on that. So then 400. Um. I'm so angry. Um. Set stage to that, okay. I got it. It was the wrong. It was the wrong one. The wiki had the wrong one. I was on 405. It's actually 410. Data model indicates a 93% chance of another DIA cache being available for exploitation. All right, fine. I can recover it. Location of cache being transmitted to your pip boy. Conversation terminated. All right, I can save that for later. So I had the wrong one. It was 10 off, all right? I can enter the report now. 
Okay. Institute report 01. Thought it wasn't a certainty. Thankfully, the signal in sector worked. When I materialized, I found myself in an empty room. Z114 can get the 13 synths in place, but in order for them to make it to the teleporter, Patriot needs the username and password for V1 and CIT's code defender. End of report. Hashtag preliminary analysis, new data commencing, hashtag analysis complete, hashtag booting HM in a race, in a race? Please consult with Pam immediately, agent. Okay, I can do that. Pam, preliminary analysis complete. Anything we need to move on. Affirmative. Code name Patriot requires admin credentials for code defender security software. Cross indexing. CIT security administrators with 2077 Commonwealth Census records. Filtering by surviving structures. One match found. Bergman, Wilfred, Bergman, Wilfred, registered as co owner of Cambridge Polymer Labs. Estimated 81% chance of login credentials being located at this facility. I know that place. Thanks, Pam. Compliment detected. Analysis? Irrelevant. After you get the password report back here. With any luck, we'll have a game plan by then. Okay. I can do that. Where is this? Oh, Medford Memorial Hospital? Where is that? It's somewhere here? That's Milton. Um, Medford is somewhere up there? Yeah, it's up there. They can, uh... Getting that later. Gotta do this now, because I split this episode into like five parts. Now, I remember going in this place, and I think the person, no, the robot going around in here, almost, I thought she was going to attack me, but she actually shut off, which was slightly depressing, but considering the fact that I was glued to the back of my seat, waiting for her to shoot at me, uh, it was, it was a Miss Nanny. far in do I have to go? Do I just go up there? Cause I forgot how to go up there. I know one of these places is the way into the... Yeah, that's the way into the lab. But I don't want to go in there. Oh, stairs. Duh. Wait, you need to go, you need farther, oh, okay, I was going the right way anyway. That's the admin's office. Probably needs the, oh, I know what it needs, probably needs one of the ones from in here. Oh, not even that one. Did the ghouls respawn? Nothing, they're fine, oh god. That retexture I got looks so good, but oh my god, it's so ugly. Boston used to be a hub for high-tech companies. You can find places like this tucked away all over the place. No, nope. God. Yes, I know about the radiation, okay? I forgot how to... Oh yeah, you gotta go through a vent and stuff. Could damn clear this place out already, or else this would be a lot longer. Password request. 
I want it on record that I highly object to giving admin rights to anyone that isn't on our core team. Admin access isn't a bauble for Dr. Williams to lord over his colleagues. We've designed a nigh-perfect system and idiotic moves like this risk everything. I've been informed that legally I must comply with this request, no matter how moronic it is. Username T. Williams, password Vernon, uh, <laughs> Vernon, exclamation point, is, exclamation point, N, exclamation point, idiot. Alright, so we have... No, it's not. Do companions come out of this place? I mean, I think... I think a lot of things that companions comment on... I was with dog meat, so I missed a lot of that. I'm afraid German boy's gonna start following me around. I don't know where he is. He was kind of glued to my back when I was here. Don't make me set stage you again. On our side, we've gone through your report. It was extraordinary. So many pieces of the puzzle clicked into place. Our final analysis indicates the Institute is far more formidable than we ever feared or imagined. No dirt. If we stage a mass breakout, Patriots 13 cents will undoubtedly be the last we ever save. Instead, we use this one chance to rescue all the sins. Every last one of them. That's called the endgame. Um, what? Okay. Explain. Is that even possible? Hopefully, Patriot's core escape plan will scale up. If it can't, well, we'll deal with it as it comes. The Institute will never let their slaves go without a fight. So the heart of our problem is manpower. Even if we call in all our agents, and we will, we won't be able to hold our own against the Institute for long. Talk with C-114. If the synths down there want freedom, they must fight and risk their lives to earn it. He seems capable. Z-1 seems capable of that. We always thought Patriot was a savior of the synths. But it may be more accurate to say that Z-1 is. As much as we owe Patriot, we can't be certain how committed he is. If he learns we're willing to kill to free since, he may not have the stomach for it. So get what you need from him and then cut him loose. Good luck. Jeez, Des. We're all with you. Okay. I'm starting to get scared, <laughs> in all honesty. Really walk the f You All right. So, this is Z1. Let me talk to Liam first. We cannot risk oh. being discovered. Probably do that first. Made arrangements. I can get the thirteen we discussed into position. But tell me, do you think Mr. Benet's plan will work? <sighs> you having second thoughts? I'd risk anything for my people. It's just that Mr. Benet is many things. But he isn't always the most practical, and this plan is very risky. Yeah. A better plan is to use this opportunity to rescue everyone, but since we'll have to fight for it. And I thought Mr. Benet's plan was too ambitious. Mm. Of course, I'd fight for my freedom, and I know of a few others that might as well. But enough to face all the guards. Perhaps. If we stand up openly to the scientists, 
Or if my people would join us. Or one of yes. you could get shot. Even if most don't join the fight, certainly there are many others who have been waiting their whole lives for this. But we should be prepared for some of the synths to fight against us. Um... All people want to be free. They just need the opportunity to take it. If the railroad inspires everyone like you do, the SRB is wise to fear you. You will give my people an opportunity, and they will flock to us. I admire Mr. Beignet a great deal. We can't tell him about this plan. It's his people we'll be fighting. I will talk to my friends. Meet me here tomorrow. If I don't make our appointment, assume the worst. Oh god. Give Z114 a day. Cool. I'm so scared that I'm going down too far in the cross line. You get me what we talked about, and I'm in business. Why do you think I'm here? Liam, I got you your username and password. You railroad guys really deliver, you know? Hooking that ancient tech up to the modern terminals is going to be seriously time consuming. Even with that password. So hand it over and I'll get started. Are you okay with violence? This is a delicate operation. Are you okay if we have to use violence? Good question. If we find ourselves in that position, we pull the plug and wait for another opportunity. Mm. We can't risk anyone's life over this. Would it be possible to rescue more synths? Those 13 synths are the only ones we're sure we can trust. If we push our luck and get the wrong synth involved, the whole thing could unravel. Oh. Here you go. Great. Listen, I need a favor. Hmm? Z114 is working the atrium again. Can you give him an update? It's safer if you do it. I think I already did. So I'm fine. Are you staying there? So I have to give Z114 a day, correct? And then once I do that, I can... I don't know if I can sleep in here, though. I, I probably can, because Sean trusts me, but... What are you going to tell oh, me my God. Mysterious phase three? You know I can't talk about that. Dr. Watson can be a little obsessive when it comes to rules and policies. What are you planning? What's phase three? I want to know. That sounds interesting. So I think when I banish myself from the Institute, I'm probably going to... Kill one of the guys in synth prevention. They all seem like a-holes. My mommy says your father's mom, but he looks so much older than you. I'll take that as a compliment, little girl. I'm pretty sure all these beds are owned. I'm not sure which one is mine. And I don't want to sit in a chair for a day. Our technology must seem pretty advanced by your standards. How do I even find a room? Carry on, ma'am. Alright, last bit. Yeah, I'm just gonna sit in a chair. I'm father's mom. There's no way anyone's going to have a problem with me sitting in their chair for 24 hours. Shut up about Oberlin Station. I don't even know how much time I have to do that now. God dang it. Alright. Uh, I would... I almost jumped down there, honestly. Safety first. Remember that. You sound like you're yawning. Like, eternally. I used to work exclusively on the synth projects, but lately I prefer less animated pursuits. Good to see you. Feeling well today? Father's work has been a real inspiration for me. I asked my friends if they'd take up arms for their freedom. I was surprised at the number of volunteers. 
Perhaps once the fighting begins, many others will join us. But we will fight and die very quickly unless we have weapons. A lot of them. Given the right materials, we can make our own crude but serviceable weapons. Unfortunately, we're missing a few critical ingredients. I probably have them. I have weapons I could give you. Excellent. Deposit anything you can spare in Maintenance Closet 3B. But we need enough weapons to arm an entire rebellion. So the ingredients are still necessary. Yay. What are they? What ingredients? Gunpowder, laser focusing crystals, and a couple other things. Um, steel weapons? Couldn't we just steal some weapons? All munitions are tightly guarded by the SRB. Even if we manage to take some, it would certainly be noticed. And surprise is essential to everything. Right. Go on. The Institute's always expanding. Excavation just completed on one of the sublevels. The mining equipment has been packed into crates and they haven't been moved yet. That equipment has everything we need. Thanks to Mr. Benet, the construction crew is populated solely by my friends. But they're under constant supervision. How do you feel about killing some guards? But who guards them? Who's guarding them? A good number of early models since. Will that be a problem? Don't think so. I'll do it. Thank you. After you eliminate the guards, we'll move the supplies and blow up the tunnels behind us. To the SRB, it will be a tragic construction accident that killed many synths. Rare, but not unheard of. And then, our dead friends can assemble the weapons we need. Good luck. I'm so afraid I'm going too far in the quest line. Honestly, if I have to kill- if I have to- oh god, but you're gonna wait. If I have to kill tunnel guards, I... I'm going to give myself angina. Okay, that, that's the thing that I can do. Now, what is this we need to do? Kill the tunnel guards, where? Um... Good day. Dr. Orman's lecture on cold fusion was nothing short of- I- I went down there before, I, I think. You're one of those people who lives underground. You live underground, you hypocrite! Sorry. Oh, yeah, I know this place. I went under. I went down here when I was getting everything from the institute. If it's just Gen ones, then it's fine. Oh God, why are they grouped? I probably want to be sneaky about it. Ooh. Oh god. <laughs> well, that did nothing. <sighs> this is why I thought that would do so much more. Alright, different weapon then? Something si- oh god, no. Oh wait, that is silenced. Then why are you not reloaded? I haven't used you in like two days. All right, let's try the AMR. Oh, he's level 79. No wonder. Contact detected. Here you are. Oh god. We should be fine. We should be fine. Oh god, they're tough. Where's the last one? Oh, look at you. Um, guys, you're not going to do anything with that. Super hot. Now that we have weapons, next time you will not fight alone. You had heavy synth pieces. Alright, my horrible super hot impression aside. 
Did I ever get a field helmet? I mean, I don't really want a helmet. <laughs> Fine. Okay, that went well. And I mean, that was kind of hard, actually. I didn't expect I didn't expect these guards to be level 79. I didn't think they'd scale with me. I should probably find what the strongest enemy is. I assume it's the Mythic Deathclaw, which I really want to fight, but you need to be level 91. I really want to see just how overpowered I am. Spend enough time here, and you'll be sick to death. Z1, it is done. Done your part. We will do ours. Weapon construction will begin immediately. Any problems? Have any problems? There's been no alarm. My friends have all the time they need to get what they want, then cover their tracks. And what of Liam? Any news about Liam? Liam's got his terminal working. When the time is right, we have someone who can operate it. I'll stall Liam as long as I can. But he's anxious to proceed with the old plan. You should avoid him if you can. If he had any idea what we're up to, I fear he'd report us. Okay. This is a good start. The greatest challenge remaining is keeping all of this secret from the SRB. So we're being very careful. Which, unfortunately, takes time. For now, please continue working with Father. We can't afford for him to grow suspicious. When my people are ready, I will contact you. Alright, I guess that's my cue. So... I'm so conflicted. Alright, I don't know if I can actually give them weapons. I mean, I have weapons, but at the same time, I'm unwilling to let go so easily. So let me look one more time at my list of things to do. Okay, so, all right, I help the Brotherhood first, and then the Institute. So next episode, I will finally, finally, finally do Shadow Steel, and probably get on the Badass Bridwin. So, until then, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and whatever bug happened in my Master of the Console, apparently. I like it if you did, if you did, if you really enjoyed it, subscribe for more from Games on Diesel Mode, and I'll see you in the next episode. Gershers.